Now, some veterans in Iberia Parish are upset after the parish council voted to take over control of five buildings where veterans meet in the parish. The, individuals, the individual boards that had oversight have been reclassified as advisory committees, which means they have no power. As News 10's Mark Rigsby reports, the board that managed one of the buildings is fuming. Veterans who use the Robert B. Green Memorial Building here in New Iberia say they are irate over the Iberia Parish Council's recent decision to take over the building. But one council member tells me this is just one big misunderstanding. We had a sucker punch. The board at the Robert B. Green Veterans Building is outraged. They say this group has special significance in that this was built more than 60 years ago for black veterans returning from war and who were not allowed in white veterans buildings. It not only punched us in the gut, but it raised its ugly head. Because in 2021, we thought we had passed what was in 1958. Robert B. Green sits on land purchased by black veterans and donated to the parish under this contract signed in 1958. In it, the veterans donated the land for the parish to construct the building. In exchange, the building would be controlled by a board of veterans. Over the years, the building became in disrepair. Former State Representative Terry Landry says he secured money from two governors to improve the building to its current state. This group believes the parish's power grab is about renting out the building to make money. Every step of the way, we were blindsided from the beginning to up to now, we were blindsided. I support all the veterans in Iberia Parish, you know, all my adult life. You know, and I really can't repay the debt they, they served, you know, for our country. However, Parish Councilman Eugene Olivier says this is not about money. But he does admit all of the veterans' buildings in the parish are in demand to use for other events. He says the parish saw an opportunity to take over the veterans' buildings so the veterans' groups don't have to pay for the upkeep of the property themselves. Yeah, I really think it's the best outcome for them, you know. You know they, they have freedom to use that building whenever they need it for all their veteran functions. Just that they don't have the responsibility of having to take care of the maintenance and operation of it. Parish government is going to assume that responsibility. I spoke with Iberia Parish President Larry Richard, and he says that he will do everything in his power to assure the veterans that they will always get first use of the building. In New Iberia, Mark Rigsby, KLFY News 10.